guys, it's Jimmy from Crafts Names and Things. So today I'm going to show you how to make these adorable little Christmas character mini candy bars. I just love them. They're so cute. And they make great stocking stuffers for your kids. You can also put them in a mug. All you need is mini candy bars. Now this tutorial is going to be a little different. So I'm going to show you how to make the Santa first. Um, we're going to do Snowman Santa and Reindeer. Um, so I'm going to show you supplies for each one rather than showing you all the supplies and getting you like, you know, oh my god, this is a lot of stuff, or, you know, confused. So we're going to start with one at a time. Let me just clear off my workspace here. So um, this is a template. I'm going to give you instructions in the box below in the description on a link to how you can download that to make the Santa. And here I just have little sequins. We'll use those later. And then I have some googly eyes, which I got from the dollar store. Um, everything for this project, pretty much, I got from the dollar store. My favorite place. <laughs> Very good. And then I have some glue. And you're also going to need a hot glue gun. And I have some construction paper here. You're going to need white, brown, and red. But for this one, you're just going to need red and white. Okay, so what I'm going to do here is I'm just going to start tracing out um, the hat for Santa. I'm just going to take a Sharpie. So you're going to need a red hat, and then you also need a red, like, little pom-pom for his hat, too. So that's what you're going to trace out on the red part. But for the pom-pom, I just used a punch. I'll show you that in a second. So all you're going to do is just trace around your templates. And then for the mustache and for the beard um, and for the rim of his hat, you'll just trace that out in white construction paper. And I am going to fast forward this so you don't have to watch me. So I'll see you in a bit. Okay guys, so now I have everything cut out, so I'm just going to make a wrapper for my candy bar. This is with the white construction paper. Um, and you're just going to kind of, I did about half the sheet, and then I just kind of used the candy bar as a template, just so I could see how wide it needed to be, or the length that it needed to be. And you're just going to take it and you're going to wrap it around. You'll probably have some access or have to cut up a little bit from the top. But you definitely want the ends of the candy bar sticking out, the mini candy bar. And just trim it as you, as you see me doing here. And then you're just going to take it and you're going to wrap it around. And like I said, you'll have a little bit of excess, so you'll just kind of just take your scissors and chop it off. And make it go around to the back. Okay. 
And you'll also need scotch tape. Sorry, I forgot to mention that. Definitely need scotch tape for this one. And you know, just readjust as, as you as you like. And you're just gonna take your scotch tape. Or you could even use a glue stick. I just use scotch tape just because I think it's easier for people to get into, but definitely use what you have. And like I said, I got most of these supplies at the dollar store. The mini candy bars I got at the dollar store. And they're just super adorable. Okay. So now we're going to put down our candy bar. And I am going to start with the hat. So I'm just going to take his red hat. And I'm going to take my punch. And I'm going to make the little pom-pom for his hat. I'm going to actually do it in white, so I'm just going to take it and give it a punch. And you can make it a skewed or you can make it straight on. But it's Santa's hat, which is totally cute. And then I'm just going to take the white, the rim of his hat, and I'm going to put that on next, just like that. And then I'll glue the whole thing down. Just like that. And then we'll take our pom-pom. And then we need to glue on his beard. So we'll take that and we'll glue that on also. And the Santa is the one that takes the longest to make. The other ones will just be a couple minutes, but. The Santa, he just has a, a lot of parts. And then I'm just gonna take my hot glue gun and I'm going to attach his eyes. And I just think it's so cute because his eyes like move. <laughs> <laughs> Which makes him a really cute Santa. Just like that. So that's the way he looks. He's so cute. And there's also um, a mustache too. So you can add that if you'd like. And I'm just going to make another wrapper. This time I'm going to make it out of white again. And I'm going to wrap it around my candy bar just like I did before. Trim off the excess. And I'm just going to tape it. This time we're going to make the snowman. And I'm going to grab my Sharpie, or any black marker would work just fine here. I mean, you could even use a pen, and that would be okay. Also, and I'm going to bring it up nice and close so you can see what I'm doing. But first, I'm going to cut off a piece of white yarn. You can use whatever yarn you want. It's just to make a little scarf for our snowman. And you're just going to make two little dots for his eyes. And then you're going to make him have a lot of small dots for his mouth. And you can make him smile, kind of however you like. And I'm just going to make that little eye dot a little bit bigger than the other ones. And then I'm going to make his nose. So I just cut out a strip and then I'm going to make it a diagonal little cut just to create a triangle. And that's going to be his little nose. As you can see there.
and then I'm going to take the piece of yarn and I'm going to give it a tie and then I'm going to use those little sequins just to give his little scarf a little bit of decoration and to hide the hot glue. And just be careful with the hot glue. As you guys know, it's pretty darn hot. <laughs> but I burned myself with this project. It's pretty delicate kind of work. So you're just going to take your little sequence things. And I got these from the dollar store. They're little, just little round, like completely round sequins. But you can use regular sequins too. And you can get a lot of them for a dollar at the dollar store. But they sell them at the craft store too. And I just think it adds a little something to his scarf. You can just kind of move around his scarf however you want. Um, I kind of like it a little bit to the right. And I'm just going to trim off that yarn. And then I'm going to take my other three sequins. And you can do two or three. They're just going to be little buttons. And I'm going to take my hot glue gun. And I'm going to stick them down. Just like that. <coughs> no, excuse me. Okay, and that's our cute little snowman super adorable and he looks so cute so those are the two that I have done and now we're gonna make our reindeer so you're gonna need a pipe cleaner which I have in my hand and we're gonna make him who's totally cute and then I just have a red piece of paper and I'm just going to punch out two circles just because I'm going to make a lot of these but you only need one just for his red nose and then you're just going to make uh, I cut the pipe cleaners maybe about an inch and a half just so they hang off a little bit And then I'm going to take my brown piece of construction paper and I'm going to make another wrapper because I want my reindeer to be brown. And I'm going to use a butterfinger this time. And you can use any kind of candy bar that you want with this. They just have to be the minis or you could do the larger ones too. That would be really cute. I have my pipe cleaners and my nose, and I have a pair of my googly eyes. There we go. So you'll just do just like we did before. Gonna cut a piece of paper that matches the sides of the candy bar and you'll wrap it around and then you'll just trim the excess off and you apply tape to the back of the candy bar Just like that. And then I'm just going to apply his antlers. So I'll just make two little lines of hot glue. 
one on each side and I'm going to apply them and then I'm going to make two little dots for his eyes And then I will take my glue stick and I will apply his nose. And there you go, you have the little cute little reindeer's face. Super easy and then you're just going to turn his antlers down or up or however you like but it looks totally cute. So that's our reindeer. And we have our snowman that we made. Just super cute. And we have Santa. So thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to share and like and subscribe. I'll see you next time. Thanks.